What's up guys, Footberg here, and yes, I am back. Probably not gonna be doing many videos, but uh, I pretty much stopped doing YouTube videos because my patron took off. Um, since then, I've actually stopped doing the patron because of things in life, and it was taking up a lot of time. Might come back to doing it again in the future, but as of now, I just got my Discord and all my mates in there, and we just have a laugh and do a bit of trading. But I thought I'd do a little video today on just basically a club tour. Um, I'm not doing FIFA as normal this year. Um, I'm making special teams. Um, I'll actually go out and I will show you all of my squads. Um, go into the squads list. This was just a team from doing the last icon swaps. Um, but if you look at the different teams I've got, I've got all the top leagues. Uh, Footbay, my main team. I've got England, Italy, Brazil, all the nations, etc. Uh, so if we just randomly we'll pick, yeah, let's have a look at look at Serie A and see what the team is there. And I've basically just got special cards. Uh, a lot of them are bought. Um, a lot of them are SBCs. Um, but at the start of every team of the week I will pick players say for instance Caputo he will have come in at around 10k what did I pay for him 10k I will pick up every single inform that is like this um, if people have watched my old uh, inform to glory videos you'll know that inform you pick them up at that price they can absolutely fly um, I have got in my club we counted um, last week 173 informs total in just under 2.9 million. So I just wanted to just go through the club, just show you some different players. Uh, I picked up this Lewandowski, uh, picked him up for 919K. Um, he's currently selling at 1,150,000, 1, something like that. So we're making making some nice profit on uh, on Lewa there. I'll, uh, I'll sell him on, um, probably in the hype of the next Bayern game. Uh, home to Leipzig because if they win that he'll go up to a 94 but also with the winter upgrade there's a chance he can go to a 95 uh, I've got Suarez, Sané not too fussed on Sané he's better as a sub um, comes on nice and quick and then we've just got the obviously the old PK which is probably one of the best SBCs we've had 263 games I've played with him uh, not really that much he fell out on my team um, as we moved on to FIFA, he's just not not as good anymore. And then we've just basically got all the specials. I've packed Mbappe and Tradable. It's the first ever big player that I've packed. Um, in the recent icon swaps, I took Bobby Moore, um, I took Van der Sar and Coman. Um, I wasn't really fussed by anybody there, um, so I just thought I'll take a couple and I'll just do the icon swaps as I uh, as I see fit. Um, but yeah, I picked up this Camaro at 200k and he's actually dropped down to like 160 so losing a few coins on him, but uh, it is what it is. Um, got the Politano uh, storyline card, I've done all the storyline cards, we still don't know how they're going to get upgraded. Um, I would imagine it's going to be some something like the um, Dan James and the Udegaard um, like objective things, it's going to be like I have to play with them to upgrade, but I don't know why we've now waited four months and we still don't know. Um, I've got a tradable Roy Keane, I use him at centre back, he's absolutely brilliant. Um, I also picked up this Martinez, I think it was 95k. Oh no, no, I picked one up at 95k and then I packed this one, and the one that I picked up for 95k is on my transfer list, and he's now only sort of like 60k on the market. Uh, but as you can see, my club is absolutely just stacked with special cards. Uh, got done a lot of the footmas cards. Um, as you can see here, we've got all those storyline cards. And as you'll see in a minute, you'll just see how many informs that I've actually got. Um, got that Guardiola from the, the first icon swaps. A lot more footmas cards, the Trossard that we've had for ages, it's never gonna, we're never gonna get told, it gets updated. I've also done a lot of the uh, SBCs, do the SBC grind. Uh, I know a lot of you will probably watch someone like Frog, 
um, and uh, he does the, the league SBC grind a lot. I've done it a lot myself this year and last year and this is where you'll start to see a lot of my informs now. All of them bought look at 12k and 84 inform now is a lot more Doherty 13k like Maguire look at that 12k 84 English Premier League centre back just pick them up when they're not needed because you've seen now a lot more SBCs um, where cards like that are needed um, and yeah just grinding league SBCs packing a lot of different 84s waiting for some um, waiting for some decent SBCs um, but yeah you can see just how stacked my club is but I've got 2.3 million coins on me on the transfer list um, I'm currently selling and what I picked up 15 player I picked him up at 20 23k uh, I think when he goes out of packs later today he's gonna end up going up over 30k I've also got I think it's 15 or 16 Visca soon as an SBC that comes out maybe like the mid icon SBC I think he's gonna fly over 30k I picked him up for I think it was 24k 25k um, as if you think of the um, the little triangle you'd have Visca Pjanic and Dzeko would be really good because um, Dzeko and Pjanic are really good fodder so Visca going there with a little triangle um, and I've also picked up from this week I think it was about 10 Asabi for 20k um, I think he will do uh, very well I've also got this Nelson Semedo I picked up 400k he's currently sat at about 430 um, what else have we got? Uh, Romagnoli, I picked him up thinking um, Theo Hernandez might get into uh, future stars. And also, I thought he might get into headliners. He didn't. Um, so I'm just going to sell this Romagnoli on. He fluctuates between about 83 and 85, so I'll try and get him gone. And um, there's that Martinez that I was on about that I bought for 95k. I packed one. And then this one I'm trying to sell. I'll wait until they're out of packs, see if he goes up in price. And then today I picked up Ricardo Pereira for 119k. He's already up to, excuse me, just over 130k. So he goes out of packs at 6 o'clock tonight. And also he should go up to an 87 with the winter upgrade. So I think I can see him going over 150k. So it'll be a nice little bit of profit on him as well. And then also I've got a few Nacho Fernandez's that I've just left um, on the transfer list for when they got a packs later. An 84, Real Madrid, right back, Spanish. I think he's going to go above 20k, I would, uh, I would presume, out of packs. And to be honest with you guys, that's pretty much it. If I was to sell everything and go completely liquid, sell all the informs in my club, all the special cards, I think I would have about 7 million. But um, I'm not really going out to buy um, like amazing players. Like this is my actual team. Let's try and find it. This is this was what I would call my main team. It's not really like a main team when you look at it, but it's probably the team I use most. And the players that I'll bring on will be Maguire, uh, Orsic, and Phillips. And I'll show you my custom tactics because I've been using a, a new custom tactic um, that I've seen Neil's guides do, which is the 5212. Um, you're on balance and fast build up. And then the formation I play is like this. So it'll actually, I'll have to change that because it should be Keane that drops back to centre back. And Balassi should be up front. And I moved Coleman into CDM because he's absolutely brilliant uh, at CDM. I had the baby, I sold the baby, and I've just completed the foot swaps for the 88 Coleman. Um, Thomas Delaney, I bought him the headliner. Bought him at, uh, what did I buy him at? About 180k. He's currently up at 260k. He is insane. If you've not had a chance to use this card, he is brilliant. Um, but I think that is pretty much it. Uh, just a 10 minute video, little tour of the club. Um, 
and uh, yeah that's pretty much it I'm back I'm gonna try and start doing a few more videos I've got a few things in the pipeline with editing um, in the future might bring back the patron it did very very well uh, considering I've only got 900 followers on Twitter I had 60 70 people in the patron uh, at its most which I think is quite good for someone with only 900 followers and everyone was very happy with the service um, so we will see what happens but until then peace